everyone, welcome to Evie's Toy House and today we're doing some prepping to make new doll customs. So if you've been to my channel recently, you probably saw these custom dolls. I've been making them and they're so much fun. So over here we have Rena Furtive, here we have Dragon Bug, and here we have an updated Rena Rouge. So I want to make more customs and in order to do that, I need more dolls. So today I have six more of these Magic Heroes dolls and I'm going to turn each of them into a custom doll over the next few weeks. So today I thought it would be fun if we reveal all the dolls together at once. So as you can see here, I have six dolls and we don't know which ones we're going to get. So we can find Rena Rouge, Bunnix, or Ladybug. What do you think? Do you think we'll find all three? I certainly hope so. All right, so let's get started. Alright, so now we have all the dolls. Let's go ahead and take them out of the bag. And here they are, all six dolls currently identical. So four of them are very good quality. As you can see, they stand up on their own. Over here, we have two that's not so great. So it seems like for these two, one leg is longer than the other one. I don't know if you can see that. So this doll is straight up here, but on the bottom, one leg is just a little bit shorter. So I'm not sure what happened. Maybe it's like a quality control one. This one is kind of the same but it's not as bad as the previous one so this one her leg her right leg is also a tiny bit shorter but it's not really big so she can still stand on her own so if you just kind of tilt her she can still stand however this one it seems like one leg the right leg is significantly shorter and so i actually have a very hard time getting her to stand so here i can try tilting her but she looks crooked when she's standing upright. And as you can see here, once I put them together, this one is just very crooked. So that's kind of a bummer because these dolls are kind of expensive. And so I would expect them to be uh, perfect, especially when it comes to limb sizes. All right, so let's go ahead and take these containers and fill them up with warm water. And here we have it, all six bottles of water. We are ready to go. Here comes our first doll. Here's our second doll. Here's our third doll. Doll number four. Doll number five. And Doll number six. How many of each do you think we'll get? Take a guess down below in the description. Do you guys see this? This is so cool. The paint is just coming off. And of course the water is turning pink. Okay, let's switch them around. Oh, we have Rena Rouge here. Here is a blue one. This one is Bunnix. This one, oh, this one is another Rena Rouge over here. Oh, look, we got another Rena Rouge, another Bun Eggs, and another Bun Eggs. Oh my goodness, we did not get any Ladybug at all. 
Now let's get the accessories out. I can see all the masks and commies. Once we pour out the water, here are all the masks, ears, and commies. So we have three tricks, three fluff, three pairs of Rena Root ears, three pairs of Bunnix ears, and of course we have all uh, the masks. All right everyone, so here are all six dolls that we got today. We got three Rina Rouges and we have three Bunnix dolls. I think that's very interesting because all together now, I've gotten 11 of these dolls and I only have one ladybug. So that means the odds are really stacked against getting a ladybug. But that makes a lot of sense to me because I think most people would want to have a Bunnix or a Rena Rouge doll since there's so many Ladybug dolls out there already. So if you're going to get these dolls, I think you have very good odds of getting a Rena Rouge or a Bunnix doll. And now that we've revealed all six dolls, we can start doing customs. So who should I start with first? Let me know down below in the comment section which six customs you want to see. And I'll see you next time. Bye!